What's up guys, Backpack Brain here, and well, Clash of Clans is now back, I guess. Well, I never really stopped as such. As such. Nice word. So, I just wanted to show you guys, uh, well, my Town Hall 5 account. I think it's pretty good. Uh, hold on. It's pretty hard to zoom in on this thing, because I'm not, obviously not recording on any iOS thing. So, well, I'm a Town Hall 5, nearly maxed out. All I have is um, six walls and my collectors and mines, um, which need, wait, let, if, I count, if I count it correctly, 12 levels. N not, e not each, but like if you count all of them, like I have three of them lying here and then two of them right. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, because these two are recording to 9. And, well, this is the definition of not rushed. And I'll just to prove it, I've upgraded my lightning spell to level 4. That costs a million elixir. And I upgraded it at the same time on my Town Hall 7 account. Alright? That's just mind-blowing. Like, to f even, even though I'm not that rushed on my Channel 7 account compared to some people, it's still, I, 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 like, finally understood what, like, the meaning was. Like, how rushed I actually was. That I was upgrading the same thing. T two Town Hall levels lower. That's just... Even though you upgrade it again at Tunnel 8, so, you know, Lightning Spurs, I wanted to upgrade for a while. Like, I can't even remember when, when my Town Hall 7 account was lower, I guess. But, uh, here's the strategy that I've been using, personally. Um, all Goblins. It might not sound like the best, but it, once you start to give up on... Try a trophy push because I really don't. I'm not big on it myself. So. I really just started this episode with no plan, but. And I hope you guys were hearing me well because my mic was down and it wasn't facing the correct way. But yeah, um, I got this base um, online um, on one of the websites that they have. Um, I modified it a little bit, moved some traps inside. Um, Took, I actually haven't. I should actually probably start removing all these obstacles. I have a lot of elixir and nothing to do with all this elixir. I'll get a lot of gems. Um, this is our clan, um, the Brain Jaws. Uh, I've said, you know, this is the official Clash Clan for Backpack Brain Bean. I think it featured on YouTube. Um, thank you. I'll just, I'll just start another one. I'm just gonna remove everything I can. Uh, I'll show you the people. Um, this is one of the people that joined our clan. He's a pretty, he's a pretty good um, town hall eight. Uh, his walls are a little bit rushed, but then again, I I sort of can talk, but at the same time, I can't talk. Like you know, like when people are like, he, people are like he didn't do this right, but who am I to judge because they also didn't do it right as well. But at the same time, I also. I have a near maxed account and a pretty le pretty rushed account, and that's interesting. So I'm allowed to judge, but not too much, I guess. Anyway, this is an interesting base. Obviously, not a dark elixir protection base. Surprisingly, he has a lot of dark elixir, even though it's like it, it shows less than half. That's actually more than half. All good signs. Yeah, I really really don't have anything to say. So he's one of the guys in our clan. Uh, he's he's pretty interesting. I've been trying to get some people to join on global, but you know, you know how it is with global people. They don't join. One, uh, I can show you this th this thing. Uh, it, yeah, I was just spamming there for a second. Yeah, I have this pretty cool replay also. You on my main account? Well, I can show it right now. But, uh, there was this guy. Uh, he, j he 
I was an idiot to accept him, but he was a pretty good, like, some people joined and left. Like, uh, this guy, uh, he was like, hi, he was like, hi, thanks, and then he did a little cute faces, like, can I please have troops? He's like, what, he's like, anything, so I gave him, um, um, five wizards, and he was like, thanks and bye, I'm just like, really? Really? I left for us. I left for some time. Well, I've forgotten why now. It's been like ages. Uh, you know, enjoy the clan world. It's like nobody there. And, and this is one of my one of my friends in real life. Yeah, great name I know. And you know, I promoted him. He's like low because yeah, he has um other friends clans that are much better. So you know, he left. So I I had a request there, and I forgot to change it because it used to be only the dragons for war attack because I was. I actually did war attacks. I know I've changed. Yeah, this is one of the guys. Um, I've showed you this guy. So, the Slayer Thirteen. Uh, right now, I'm just promoting everyone to Elder. Now, this is this is a, he's a little bit more rushed than me, but I don't. I, but I feel like um, that's fine. You know, I, I'm not exactly about to judge. I feel like he's recently accorded to Town Hall Seven, and he's done pretty well. To get all the stuff up and running, he already has minions. Seriously, why do you only have one minion? I'm so confused. So, sure he could work on his base design and upgrading his stuff, but he clearly just upgraded, so he's doing a much, much better job than I am. And, you know, I appreciate that. Like, when people, pe people come to, uh, when people are in a clan who it's just recently upgraded and you can sort of the similar level to you but you can sort of relate to them I don't know what I'm talking about I can't relate to this guy he has three builders I only have three builders in this account ha <laughs> seriously I have three builders in this account the reason I'm saving a builder obviously is so that I can upgrade these six walls then I'll start you know upgrade the rest of my collectors and stuff like that I still haven't removed these stones because, you know, walls over stones. Couldn't you just break these and then use it on the walls, though? Wait, hold on, let me just count the, count the stones. It would take 100,000 loot to, like, 100,000 gold to get rid of all my stones. So, walls. No, wait, 110? Wait, no, 1, 2, 3. Wait, no, hold on, let me count. One, with, I'm with my finger in real life. One, two. It's so hard to count. Six. Counting two of these is one big stone. So that's 120, in fact. One, two, three, four, five. Six. Silence. So I'm. Um, I'll go ahead and actually do a live raid. Um. F but first, I'll show you guys the replay of um. I. This is me donating. Um. I could technically chat to myself, but I'm not going to because that's something that's pretty weird. And, yeah, this is a pretty cool raid that I got a lot of loot on, on my, um, channel, channel, um, five, five, um, seven. So, right now, that's, that's what I'm doing on my channel, 180 goblins and three ice spells. Yes, I haven't maxed out my Kami camps. Please don't, please, like, calm down. I don't, well, no one's non calming down, but, like, it costs 750 and I do have that much on my account right now. So it takes a long time to get it and my build is working on my elixir storage because that isn't maxed out. Um, so, you know, this is an inactive base. It's like nothing in the storages, I don't think. Almost nothing, if I remember correctly. I just sort of went all out. Blue rage spells, obviously there are cheaper options, but heal spells w won't be effective with goblins because they're pretty weak health. Weak health. And lightning spells, I really, I don't think I can, I'll be able to take out 
mortars for landing spells enough to make the raid actually change the raid. Oh, the snow spores. That's funny. So I just uh, uh, it takes around um ten goblins to take out. Wait, 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 ten goblins to take out. Yeah, and they also attack clan castles now. It takes around ten goblins to take out one resource building if there's not a splash damage targeting them. Even if there is. So I'll just drop five more goblins over there and make sure that got taken out. Well, you know, just drop the stream some goblins in there, you know. Because the more, since the more I didn't, t doesn't take them out in one shot, I could basically drop enough goblins so that they wouldn't be taken out. They would take out the building fast enough to dodge the second or the first, depending on what you're talking about. Motor shot, like, see that? They dodged it. And that's some free dark elixir for me there, you know. I just dropped a couple goblins on the town wall, took that out. The rest of the dark elixir are probably in the storages. So I sort of just dropped a couple goblins there that went around. Actually, it's in here, in the um, drill. There's like a hundred in the storages. Oh, some pretty good dark elixir for me as well. Yeah, so, you know, I'm just sort of streaming the rest of my goblins. There's only a 40 left. I didn't need my rage spells for this because, you know... Why would I need rage spells? But rage spells and goblins are a, a surprisingly good combination because of the damage they do. A couple goblins and a rage spell will take out so many um, resource buildings. If you, if people keep them on the outside, if they're going for trophies instead of loot. See, look, I've take see, look, I've taken out almost all of the loot. So there's like two hundred, it's like three hundred elixir and a hundred dark elixir. So I'm not, I'm no way I'm gonna touch that. But I don't. I really. I, I was out of board, so I just streamed the rest of my goblins in and look at the health of this thing. And this, even though it's empty, still, the goblins, the, that one coin might hold a little bit of value. So I'm sort of like, mm, should I leave them? Should I keep them? I'm like, ah, uh, screw it. I, I was just checking because you can never trust my. You can never trust my eyes. I was che checking if there are any more. Um, b buildings that ha that were like loot wise. Yeah, and it ends, like, right there. Like, look at the health of that thing. One goblin punch will take it out. Even one punch from me could take it out. And that's saying something. So, let's go off on a live raid. Um, I'm not going to edit it out because, well, I actually might edit it out. That's a good idea. I'm going to do that. I'm gonna, I'll, I will edit the finding of the raid out. So, I'll see you guys in some time. Hopefully with some good loot. Okay, looks like we found some pretty decent loot, even though most of it's in the storages. I'm just gonna go for it, because screw it. Screw my trophies. So, I'll just drop a couple couple on there. Th they should take that out. Drop like seven more here. I'll just pull like a couple there. That should take that out. Um, While well, that's distracted, oh, there are some goblins. There are some giants and stuff. Oh, oh, oh we took that out. And it doesn't. The archers, they'll be so slow that they'll, their archer hits will just fall on dead dead goblins and <laughs> giants. Normally they'd be a pain, but you know, goblins. There we go. This should troll this guy. I want to take out his clan castle before I take out his clan castle troops. I'm bored. That's fine. And the raid's over. Well, I still have my lightning spell, but I'm not going to drop that. So, 
that for 135 goblins um, let me do some quick math here in my head or I just have a calculator right next to me it's called phone one sec calculation Okay, that's not bad. So we have we have a profit of around twenty eight thousand, twenty seven thousand elixir, and well, any gold is a profit really, because I didn't spend too long searching for this. And well, if I, now that you think about it. Trophies don't matter that much, especially at this kind of level. Later on, when I have better, more efficient three-star attacks, you know, such as such as like Tunnel Tunnel Seven Dragons, you know, I'm probably I'm probably gonna get to Tunnel Seven before I max out my Tunnel Seven on my um main account over there. Oh, I this might actually be my better account. Like, like the troops over here for the Tunnel level, they're a lot better. Um, I feel like. I'm using this account more and more nowadays, maybe because, you know, I have it more accessible recently, but stuff like that, and well, I feel like for the, th it takes like 30 seconds to train up one goblin, so, so, so I don't need a calculator to, to realize that it doesn't take that long to train up all of this, so, yeah, they're already training up, and that's 30 already. So, so if I just reduce this all by five, so you see it takes what seventeen eighty minutes. That doesn't take that long. You could go outside. You could stay inside, watch a YouTube video, and well, that's just some quick, nice and easy profit. We're gonna be able to upgrade two more walls. That leaves us with four walls, the collectors, and the mines left. So that's gonna be it for this video. No, it's not because I forgot to check out the other people, the other guy in this clan. Sorry, guy. If you're watching this, you should be. Uh, this guy, he's a pretty decent town eight. Um, he looks um to his air defenses are a little bit low. You know, even my town eight seven air defenses are maxed out. Surprisingly enough, uh, he looks like he's been, looks like he's on a shield right now. Doesn't look like there's too much loot in there. I might have raided him. You know, this is probably for his upgrading something. Just, just whole bunch of stuff. And I think his base is pretty good. You know, he he's gonna be a very, very valuable, very valuable, very valuable to to our clan. So if you wanna join this clan, um, wait, let me just edit this. So it's international. Um, we'll make it, we'll keep it 800, we'll make it 600, you know, people might be doing the same strategy, copy me. So, if you want to join this clan, uh, then, uh, wait, let me, I'm trying to type it, talk at the same time. I'm not good at this, so, if you want to join this clan, then, it's tunnel 5 and up, um, I, if you... If you are farming down in very low trophies and still want to join, I can always lower it. Um, right now, if anyone can join and there isn't a wall frequency because we haven't walled yet, um, we're hoping, hoping at least, to to start like maybe warring soon. As soon as we get the players, I'm gonna change it to this because I like this color. And so, well, I really don't have too much to say. And I hope you do join this clan. It's pretty good. It's, it's, it's good. It's a good, nice clan. <laughs> I'll just tell anybody who comes online. Yeah. So I'll just I'll just send a mail as well.
so let me do that um hmm. do, do, do. Ba -ba -da. I feel like that's about it um I'm actually pretty high on trophies considering I don't have much left for this video if you see yeah you know I'm getting you and you should have really recorded things a lot faster anyway how much but for most su surprisingly enough most attackers don't take much of my dark elixir I think it's because gold for me is the place where people don't raid you for your dark elixir or if they do they give you trophies so it's either that it's either that you lose your dark elixir or they lose your trophies and um, I feel like that's a, that's a that's a, it's a fair enough trade-off but for the amount of dark elixir they take because the, the more they take the less they take the less chance that they'll take more afterwards if I'm raided because there's less dark elixir to be raided for me. I guess. That's how it goes. Yeah, I was kicked out of Spartan's Legacy because I wanted it to be my clan and they didn't believe me. Uh, my cousin brother left that clan, he joined another clan and a whole bunch of stuff like that. And well, you know, I don't have much to say about that, personally. This was supposed to be a short video, but it's pretty sad. Uh, this don't, this this guy is pretty, pretty amazing. Tunnel nine. What's your tunnel, my friend? Oh, okay, you're on tunnel nine. And if we go ahead and oh. Hello, hello hacker. I hope you don't hack my account. So, if you if you need some reminders, his, his base. It's a really, really good base compared to anything, really. He's, 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 he was a maxed out Tunnel 7. Now he's going to be a maxed out Tunnel 8. Apart from Barracks, we're going to get him. We're going to be able to upgrade all the Barracks to Tunnel 7. Probably should, but you know. That's good. That's going to be it for this video I guess thing um I do hope that you liked it and mm, stuff like that because I need I need st people to like me please like me go like me like okay, I'm not gonna sing that song I'm really not Wait, let me see if you've trained up any troops. No? Alright. be. Silence. But I do hope you have enjoyed. And I'll see you I will see you guys in the next video. No, no, no. Hold up, hold up. It's the wrong channel. Wait, did I edit that out? I'm, I'm fairly sure I edited that out. Yeah, if you wanna... Uh, my defense log it isn't doing so well. My attack log, by, by the way. I bet this, look at, seriously, look at the profit on these guys. Look at the profit, and I even won the trophies, like, how does...
Like that is a lot of good. We both have to agree. I don't know why it's we both. Like um, you're all one person right now. Okay, you've all merged. Let's call it like that. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave a like and subscribe. Comment any suggestions. Um, if you want to join my clan, let me hold you and go ahead and put up the clan tag. Um, I've also tweeted the clan tag of my of Clash Royale. If you want to join that, um, I also play that. Uh, hopefully, I'll be able to. Hopefully, once to get it out on Android, I'll be able to like get some stuff up because I don't have the capability to record an iOS on well, I don't know, on anything really. So. Hope you guys enjoyed. I've donated a lot of clips. 53 isn't a lot, but hey. Let me do that. Yes, I love a train afterwards. Don't mind me. And well, I hope you had any. I hope you had any fun. Any fun? I'm talking nonsense, rambling, and stuff like that. And well, I'll see. I'll see you guys later. Bye. Seriously, bye. Get out. Get out of the video. Close it right now.